go to jail. Well, I'm Artifacts of Mars. Maybe you've heard Maxine's Waters uh, rant. If you haven't, you need to listen to it because uh, this woman, it's time that she was hauled away, either in handcuffs or in a straitjacket. Personally, I prefer handcuffs, but uh, we can dicker that out later, whether she goes to a loony bin or a jail cell. However, what she did recently is a crime. It's a federal crime. I'm going to show you that I know what I'm talking about. If you haven't listened to the rant, listen to it because uh, you can't do this. I'll read a little bit. Uh, already you have members of your cabinet that are being booed out of restaurants who have protesters taking up, taking up at their house and say, no peace, no sleep, no peace, no sleep. Waters continued. That is harassment. God is on our side, Waters declared. Uh, not the God I've read about. Waters then called for attacks on individual members of the Trump administration, saying, We make sure we show up wherever we have to show up, and if you see anybody from the cabinet in a restaurant, department store, gasoline station, you get out and you create a crowd and you push back on them, and you tell them they're not welcome anywhere, anymore, anywhere. You can't do that. Tell them they can't lead their lives. That is worse. That is harassment and it's incitement to riot. I got a little bit of a sore spot in my tongue, so that's kind of hampering me a bit. I'm going to show you uh, the U.S. Code here. I already called Congressman Chris Collins, which does no good because he don't listen, but. Uh, here it is 18 U.S. Code, Section 2102. As used in this chapter, the term riot means public disturbance involving one, an act of, or acts of violence by one or more persons, part of an assemblage of three or more persons which act or acts shall con constitute a clear and present danger of or shall result in per damage or injury to the property of any other person or to the persons the individual or threats threat or threats of the commission of acts of violence or by one or more persons part of an assemblage of three or more persons having individually collectively the ability to immediately execute such threat or threats while well, the performance on the threshold of the acts of violence would con constitute a clear and present danger of or would result in damage or injury to the property of any other person or the person of any other individual. This is, uh, you know, she's clearly in violation of this. And she needs to either be, she needs to be arrested and either taken to a mental hospital for psychiatric examination or a jail cell. I would prefer a jail cell, to be honest with you. I think she knows exactly what she's doing. But, like I said, we can hash that out later. Right here it is. This is Cornell Law Journal. I don't think much of Cornell, but their law journal, you know, it's the authorita authoritative uh, piece of information you can get on this. 18 U.S. Code, Section 2102, Incitement to Riot. And we'll probably get a few other charges on her as well. Contact your congressman or woman or whatever and demand that this woman be reined in, hauled away in handcuffs or straitjacket. You gotta do it, folks. This has gotten out of control. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.